Hello, I'm going to listen to Sean James, Through the Valley. Uh, it's from the Western AF channel, which I absolutely love. And I check out all the time to see what new music is on there. I know Sean James. I have heard his music before and he is amazing. So I am excited about this. This has been in a weird tilt and it's been bothering me. It's like, hello. Hey. <laughs> Needs to be a little bit further down. I don't know. I'm hot. It's hot in here. Sean James, Through the Valley. Makes me think of that song. Through the valley of the shadow of death. It's like a, like a rap song. It's like, to do through the valley of the shadow. I don't know. And then the, um, that's his face. Uh, they did a parody of it about the Amish gangster's paradise. You know. Most of our lives living in a gangster's paradise. And then they did the Amish paradise thing. Amish, Amish paradise. Anyways, <laughs> I'm guessing this has something to do with through the valley of the shadow of death. I think that's the way it goes from, from the Bible. I don't know. Let's see. I wrote through the valley many, many years ago. Uh, I'm born and raised from Chicago, Illinois. And at one point, my upbringing, my parents uh, decided to become Pentecostal and brought me into that as well. Um, and those weren't the best times for me, uh, mainly because I was never really accepted as one of their own and I was always kind of an outcast. But you know, I got through it, I got over it, and I moved on. And then years and years and years later after that, I get a call from my little sister who's 12 years younger than me and she was going through a lot of the same stuff that I had gone through. And after, uh, helping her out and kind of giving her some tips and advice on the phone. I got off the phone and I was reflecting on those times that I had gone through and uh, I got inspired to recreate the 23rd Psalm and it became Through the Valley. Ooh, it's gonna say, if you're, I, I know you can't always help it, but if you're a church, I think the best thing to do is to be nice and accepting of people make people feel comfortable i know you're trying to teach your certain message so you don't want people to be i don't know going against what you think is right in your church but how about try to like just be kind and teach lessons and but like, just be more open and accepting of people and, you know, be more Jesus, Jesus like, you know, because from the stories I've heard, Jesus is, you know, he's kind to everybody, no matter if they're some poor beggar on the street or a prostitute or anything like that if it's a sinner whatever he's kind to them and accepting of them and will you know bring them in so why are so many churches when you enter them feel so judgmental and not very um like accepting of new people and it's like they're pushing people away. I don't understand that. Does it make sense to me? The majority of churches and things that I've been to, I felt that way. But there's been a couple um, that were super nice and, ex you know, come on in. We accept everybody. We don't care what your background is, how you're dressed, you know, if you're covered in tattoos and piercings and, or if you're, I don't know, different lifestyles, different, different things. 
like to just accepting of people because that's I think what you're supposed to be kind of like anyways <laughs> I like him playing guitar in just the middle of a church like that. That's a pretty cool setting. Stop it right when he's done whistling. I love a good whistle in a song, especially custard, uh, custard, country western type music. If you got a good whistle, that's good. And he's a really talented whistler. You can tell it's like like a bird. Beautiful. I used to whistle good. And now I'm like I don't know because I'm fat or something. I was just like <laughs> can't get you, catch my breath and I lose my. It doesn't sound very good anymore. Uh, anyways, I love this. 10 out of 10. Amazing. No complaints. It's just fantastic. I love Sean James. Um, I love the lyrics. It's just beautiful sounding. Love it. Definitely going on my playlist and I'm definitely listening to it a million times. He got deep with it. I sit alone and I die. My soul is dead. Now I know when I die. Now. 
Ugh, the whistle again. Ugh. I like those spin old fashioned spinny wheel windmill thingies. Oh gosh. <sighs> I'm a little bit in love with Sean James. Just a little bit. Oh my gosh. I'm just a man with a guitar. And it sounded so amazing. Just a man with a guitar in a church. I know y'all probably don't feel the same way as me, but I think it was freaking fantastic. I don't know. Maybe you do. If you clicked on the video, maybe you do. Anyways, like, subscribe, leave comments down below that are nice, and have a nice day. Bye.